Greetings YouTube, welcome to another episode of I Am Unbox. Today we are continuing our Fast and Furious uh, car collection. Um, so yeah, so this is the fourth in the in the in the collection that I've been able to get my hands on. And today we're gonna be doing the Ford GT from the Fast and Furious films. I think I, from what I can remember, this is a car that they, they tried stealing in, in, in one of the films from that scene, that train scene, I think. I can't really remember, but yeah, not seen that one for a while, but Ford GT, what a beauty of a car, this. I mean, I love Ford GTs. I really, really like them. Uh, I'm absolutely going to be getting a yeah, 118 version, not the Fast and Furious one. I mean, I do like this one because you know, it's kitted out, isn't it? Uh, but just a standard Ford GT. I mean, I just love the the design of this car. So yeah, again, Jada Toys, uh, diecast, part of that range that um, I'm collecting. Um, so yeah, so let's make a start on this one then. So, so yeah, if, uh, these four GTs. I mean. They are, uh, I think the Ford GT began as a concept car. Um, good, good, powerful car. 5.4 litre supercharged modular V8 engine. Um, very, very, uh, you know, this is very powerful. It's not, a, like I always say, it's not a lightweight, but it's just the de design of this car is absolutely beautiful. Um, it's, it's just, it's, it's got like a classic look to it, classic old school car look, but with like a modern twist. Um, six speed, uh, 550 brake horsepower. Um, I've seen the 2017 versions of this car, the Ford GT, and that just looks awesome. So, uh, so let's have a closer look at this. Wow, look at that beautiful color on this one. Absolutely beautiful. Great detail on the artwork, as expected from Jada Toys and this range. Very, very nice on the details. So let's just get this one out. Um, yeah, so like I was saying, it's a very fast, powerful car, this one. Uh, 550 on the brake horsepower. Um, 0 to 62 in apparently 3.9 seconds so you know good good fast little motor here that we've got i don't i want to surprise that we're trying to seal this one in the film <laughs> so here we have it so let's just try and get these screws out. oh i don't think these ones are going to be a bit tough they're not the same as the other ones so yeah that'll do right yeah so uh, yeah so looking forward to this one see you know the functionality of this i mean the last one, the Supra, the Toyota Supra, that was just awesome, wasn't it? I mean, we had like a, um, uh, you know, we had the, the uh, roof on it that, you know, we could just take off and put on, which was awesome. Very, very good little feature. Um, this screw's a little bit tough, so... Looks like somebody's already tried getting this one out, but they've not been successful in doing so. So, what I'll do is I'll... Try my best to get this one out, and I'll see you back in a minute. Okay then, so finally managed to get this one out of the uh, packaging. Those screws were a nightmare. So I think, I think like like I mentioned this last time, uh, I think because these cars are imported in the stores, what they do is they they have to take them out to make sure there's no you know dodgy stuff inside the cars. And I think they try opening the screws up, and whoever opened one of them screws up, they literally just ruined the head of the screws you couldn't get it out so i had to physically kind of take it out with a piece of plastic but anyway not to not to worry because we finally managed to do it so let's just have a closer look at this then wow very very nice this is just beautiful just look at this wow unbelievably good brilliant brilliant stuff let's just get rid of the uh the remaining plastic on this and then we can have a closer look. So yank that out. Open this one here. Oh, there's a third one. I've not been disappointed with Jada Car so far on this um, collection. So uh, let's just have a look. Very nice. Look at them wheels. <laughs> Look at them awesome, awesome wheels. Sometimes because of the tape that they put on, the wheels do get a little bit dislodged. Well, not the wheels, just the rubber. So you do have to kind of just pull it, pull it into place. But that's uh, that's an easy little job to do. It's not a huge issue. 
It's a bit daft the way they do the packaging on these, actually. They do, they, they're very aggressive on the packaging. Don't really need that many tapes on it. I mean, if they're going to put them on, put them on properly. Um, right, there we go. That's enough of me complaining about the packaging. Let's just admire this car. Wow. Just look at the aerodynamic shape of this car. It's such a low car as well. Beautiful. Great detail on them wheels with the um, brake discs and the calipers, coloured calipers. Nice detail on the side lights. Look at that. Beautiful detail on that. Let's have a look at the front. Yeah. Very, very good detail on there. Look at the detail on them lights. See, none of this looks like the cheap stuff that you get from the... Well, I won't mention what brands, but... You know, you can get cheap versions of cars and then you can get decent versions like this. Very nice. Look at that great paintwork on there. Look at the grill. Very nice. Look at the air vents and grills. Beautiful, beautiful detail. Again, side view with Ford on the side. Oh, and look at that back light grill. Awesome, awesome design. Fast and Furious written there as per standard. Beautiful design. I mean, there's just something about the backlights being circular that I just love. Again, I've said this before. I love circular lights, especially on the back of cars, uh, and which again, which is why I love Corvettes. And I can't wait to do me unboxing of me uh, me Corvettes. And again, this has got that on on the back. So let's just have a look at the top. Great design. Look at that for design. Beautiful, beautiful lined design. Great stripe on the middle that paintwork is beautiful as well just look at that it's a shame i haven't got a very uh, good camera i will be getting one very soon i'll be doing an unboxing on that but at the moment i'm just have to make do with the uh, the iphone 5s camera but the paintwork on this look at the texture of that metallic paint beautiful stuff very very nice just have a look at the base yep solid base wheels work nicely and let's just have a look at the working parts now. Oh, oh look at that. <laughs> I didn't expect that to open. Just look at that. Look at the front there opening. That's the, uh, you can call it the front boot, if you like. Bit of space to put your, I don't know, your, your luggage. Yeah, little bag, more like. And then we have the back that opens up really nice. Showing off the engine. Nice bit of detail on the engine there. Um, let's close that. Let's have a look at the doors. Oh, look at them doors. See the see the top part of the door coming out. Very good. And there you have it. The classic chrome finish on the wheels and the uh, pedals. And look at that gear stick. Oh, and oh, there's even a chrome finish on the uh, center mirror, the rear mirror. Awesome stuff. And uh, don't know if you can see on the um, uh, on the on the camera, but you've got the uh, dials. The stickers on the dials, very nice, very nice indeed. Just look at them pedals, four pedals, awesome stuff. Very good on the detail, very good indeed on the detail indeed. Let's have a look at this um, side door. Yeah, opens up nicely. None of that wobble rubbish that you get with the cheaper cars. Um, again, great work, great work on the seats. Even on the floor mats, they've got like, uh, like these dots on the floor marks. Great work on the dash. Yeah, I know I'm really, really impressed with this. Yeah, I was expecting it to be good, and they've not let me down. So, only one thing left to do now, isn't there, folks? We've got to give this a spin. So, let me just make sure that these wheels, are, the tyres are lined up properly. Don't want to be giving it a spin with unaligned tyres now, do we? Right, so let's give this a spin. Oh, look at that. Oh, it just, it just sounds awesome, that, doesn't it? Right. So, yeah, really pleased with this one. Let's just line this up. So this is the third in the edition. Oh, I didn't have a look at these side mirrors. Oh, these are rubber, rubber side mirrors. And they don't have any, they don't even have foil on them. So I guess that's one little, uh, you know, I guess I can say, well, it's not, I'm, I'm not going to complain too much. But they could have at least put some foil on the side of the mirrors to give a bit of reflection. But, hey, it's all good. It's all good. So let's bring out the others, eh? Let's bring out... Mr. Supra, Brian Supra, and of course, Dom's Dodge Charger RT. Oh, look at this for a collection, eh? This is looking pretty awesome. I would love to collect every single one of these. And I tell you what, if I could get my hands on them from a retailer here in the UK, um, 
I, I would I would literally buy all of them um, they just look amazing but again I still think that these are not 124s because my 124s on the other collection they're about they're about that big let me just go get one and I'll show you so if we look at this over here we've got the Ferrari I mean look at that that looks so much more smaller even than the uh, even than the Ford so I don't I don't understand I mean they don't have 124 written on the packaging so I guess I'm just assuming that they're 124 but they're definitely not a 118 because 118s are about this big they're about that big and that wide so I don't really know what to call them I'm probably just going to make a playlist and just call them the Fast and Furious cars big versions and then we're going to have the small ones as well so I don't know whether I can really call these 124s but yeah let's move LaFerrari out of the way don't want him to uh, ruin the Fast and Furious show here so hopefully I'll have one more coming soon and um what I'll do is I'll leave a link in the descriptions below for you to have a look at and, you know, read all the reviews on or purchase if that's what you want to do and collect with me. Uh, links to these cars. Um, again, they sometimes they come in double packs, like you can get this one and this one in a big double pack. Um, and, yeah, so we're really pleased with this collection. Um, and, yeah, so let's just, uh, to be honest with you, I want to, I want to open another one right away. But I better calm myself down, so uh, just relax, uh, I'm on box. <laughs> so please subscribe to the channel if you already haven't done so. Please give the video a thumbs up, and I shall see you on the next one. So take care of yourself, and peace.